Hello, Earth Signs. Welcome. My name is Tisa, and it's so great to have everyone here. I am here right now, and I'm looking into June the 23rd through the 24th of 2023. This card will flip out here right away. This one is you're being helped. Okay. Earth Signs right here. All right. Message, please. Earth Signs is Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. June the 23rd and the 24th of 2023. Everything you need to know about me is down below in the description box. Thank you for your love and your support. Okay. Let's see what we have here. This is Earth Signs. It's Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo. I'm feeling like nobody can stop you. Something like that. Somebody cannot stop you in some way here. Okay. All right. Let me see what else here. Earth Signs is Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo. Okay. All right. So we have Free Yourself right here. We have Past Life Relationship is right there. What you need to accept right here is this Flower Power card. And then I have the Shine card right here. And you're being helped. All right, so let's see what's going down right here. This is Earth Signs. It's Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo. The deck I'm using right here to clarify things is Tarot in Space. And on the bottom of the uh, box here, you can see that the Comets is the cups, the lasers are the swords, the planets are the pentacles, and the rockets are the wands in this particular deck right here. Okay, so let's go ahead and jump into it. What you need to know, okay, put this like this. What you need to know is that you're being helped and that heaven is working behind the scenes to help you, even if you haven't seen some results right here yet. Okay. All right, because the last time I did a reading for you, I was getting the same thing right here. See how she's up here, all delightful and peaceful. And we got these sharks down here or something like that. So I don't know what's going on there. Okay, but I feel like they get being helped. So, okay. All right, so I'm like, you're still peaceful or something like that. So three of wands right here is reversed and the sun is reversed right here. Okay, so somebody delayed their happiness right here in the future in some way. All right, yeah, they delayed their happiness. I feel like you're being helped with that energy, okay, because they delayed their happiness in some type of way. And with the shark right here, I'm not sure if they feel some type of way about it, something like that. Could be the case. See, the sea full of sharks right there, but I feel like you're still at peace up here or something like that right here. You still like you're at peace to me at the top, right? All right, what's the message? You're being helped right here. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Earth Signs, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Two of Wands right here. Yeah, you've been helped what to do or something like that. What action to take, what path to go down, something like that. You're being helped, I feel like, on your path. Um, if you remember that one passage, he said, it was then I courage you, my son. Something like that. So I kind of feel like that footprints. Yeah, the footprints. Um. Um, poem, right? So I feel like somebody's like, well, where were you? Something like that. It was then I encouraged you. So I feel like right here, you're being helped about what pathway to go or something like that. Okay. Um, the Queen of Wands right here. I feel like you still shine bright in some way. Um, I feel like you're a leader. You're entrepreneur. Your beauty is incredible right here. Okay. And you're being helped in some type of way with that in some way here. Okay. Could be a Sagittarius right here. We have a Leo too. It could be significant some type of way here. Okay, it could be somebody does want to reconcile with you, could be the case here. So the Tempest card could be reconciliation, but this Tempest card also could be perfect balance. Maybe something here is perfect balance in some way, could be the case. Okay, all right, this shine card right here, and it says right here, step into the light, you are a gift to the world. Okay. So, it's time for you to shine. It's time for you to step into your light, your gift to this world, some type of way. The universe is going to help you whichever path you need to go in some way. Um, with the footprints card right here, it's like the universe is going to make sure something happens in some type of way. I mean, I'm even like guiding my footsteps or footprints, all right? It's like, where do you leave an imprint at? You know, when you make a step, every step can make a footprint, right? Especially if you're walking on sand or dirt or um something like that it's like it leave an imprint right so i feel like you the universe is guiding your steps to where you leave your footprint at so i kind of feel here what's the shine card what's the shine card right here for earth signs right here yeah this is you right here the taurus capricorn and virgo right here the king of pentacles is taurus capricorn and virgo i'm gonna like you is you're gonna shine you're gonna make money okay i feel like it's gonna be for the world to see or for somebody to see right so, um, 
But I just kind of feel over here you're protected though. Because you're going to be guided which way to go about everything I feel in some way. Yeah, definitely this is money. You're going to make money right now I feel for somebody here. Somebody's definitely going to make money right now. Ten of Pentacles and the King of Pentacles and the Shine. Okay, you're going to make money right now I feel for somebody here. You're going to trade it. Okay. Um, so, yeah. I'm getting like you're going to get a message about money. Somebody's going to get the message right here. It's about money right here. Okay. Yeah. For a pentacles. I'm going to like, you're going to get so many deck deck or messages right here. You're going to get a message about money. Definitely. You're going to get a message right here. Where to go. What footprints to make. What steps to take. Everything like that. I feel like you're definitely being guided here some type of way. Okay. Um, the four pentacles. Where to leave your money could be the case. Where should I put my money at? Something like that. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. You could be guided right here what to say. I'm getting right here too. I'm getting like, you get a download, it's going to come straight from a higher source. Like, I feel like you're all the way intuitive. Somebody here could be. It could be all the way intuitive. It's coming straight from above, I feel, right here with the judgment card right here and the eight of wands right here. Okay. All right. I'm getting like something that you're saying. Eight of Wands could be saying it. It could be speaking it out. Could be the case. All right. Um, it, it could be something about your voice for some people right here. For the judgment right here, you could even be awakened that you really do have this powerful voice or something like that. Could be the case. Maybe you sing or you um rap or something like that. Could be the case here. Okay. Um, that that could definitely be the case right here. All right. But I do feel like, you know, the Judgment and the Eight of Wands the, and the Shine card, you will definitely be seen. Somebody's going to be awakened to you in some way. All right. The Flower Power card right here, it says, spend time with the flowers and the flower essence to increase your personal healing power. So some of you, you may even be surrounding yourself with flowers in some type of way. Could be the case here. All right. What's the Flower Power card right here? Message, please. For Earth signs, Taurus Capricorn and Virgo right here. All right, so we have the King of Swords right here. So the King of Swords is Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. It's somebody here that's very intellectual, very truthful, okay? You could be around an air sign, maybe. What's the message right here? Because either this air sign is giving you some knowledge or you spit some knowledge right over here to the air sign for some people right here. Okay, yeah, the Justice card is reversed over here and the Six of Cups right here. Okay, this is a Libra right here. The Justice is Libra. And then this King of Swords right here is also Libra right here. Okay, but it's a crazy in Gemini too, but something happened in the past over here. Okay, it definitely could be a Libra right here, Justice card reverse. Like something was unjust that happened in the past or something like that. It could have been when you was a child, or this was a child. This is a child right here, and this one right here is a child. So I'm not sure if something here is unjust about something that happened when you was a child, or something about a child in some way. It could be a Libra. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, somebody's going to get bad karma for something over here with the Justice card reverse. They're going to get bad karma for something. I feel like they have to watch you right here, be in the front, make money or something. Could be the case right here. But the strength card is reversed right here. And the king of wands could be an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, a Leo, or a Virgo right here. I don't get like, or Libra, something like that. Somebody has bad karma here or something right here. It makes them weak. Or something they did in the past is very weak right there. They're going to get bad karma for it, something like that. Yeah, something like what goes around, it definitely, you come back around, it definitely comes back around for somebody right here. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah, I feel like somebody now wants a, a new start right here with you or they want to travel right here to you or something like that. Ace of Wands right here and a Ten of Cups. They even want to be a family with you for some people right here. Okay. Two of Pentacles right here. They want to negotiate something right here with you, I feel. All right. They could be in regret for some people right here because they was juggling you. Maybe they, maybe they was. This is bad karma over here with this flower power card. So, I feel like um, somebody, you know, the flower power is, is all about flowers. Maybe somebody here, you know, is going to have flowers around them in some way. You know, flowers can be uplifting. So, that could be the case. You know, sometimes when people are going through grief or something like that, some people get them flowers. So, that could be the case over here. All right. But I feel like, you know, something they did before in the past, it really does put them to their knees right now. Okay. Like this something right here is going to put them to their daggone knees right here. The strong card reverse. Something they've done right here in the past. It's bad karma now for it right here. 
Okay, so past life relationship, it says you've known each other before. So this could be somebody from your past in some way. Now, it certainly could be past life, but it could be just somebody from the past. Okay, so let's see. Past life relationship right here, please. Yeah, it's your source right here. Maybe I didn't even know there was from your past life or something like that. I'm getting like past life reading. Maybe you have past life reading like that. Yeah, they're heartbroken right here. Somebody's heartbroken right here. Could be a younger um fire sign or an air sign. Pray, sleep, or Gemini. Okay. But somebody look at you in awe, I feel. They see that you're really good. You're really good news, I feel, for somebody here. Just pray you. You're really good news right here, I feel. They're heartbroken right here. Because I feel like whatever's going on here, this comes from a past life. This I'm getting right here. Because this bad karma situation over here, I feel like it's coming from this life and a past life for some people right here. So they was going to be heartbroken about something right here. Okay, because something that happened in the past life is also significant here, I feel, in some way. All right, I feel like this goes deep to a past life. Free yourself, I said. It says it's time to take back control of your life. Okay, so some of you, you're going to free yourself about something. I feel like you know that all things is possible in some way. For this unicorn on here. Yeah. Yeah, how pieces you're very intuitive right here. Okay. I'm gonna be like secrets is known to you. Something like that right here. You could be a high priestess, maybe. Free yourself from here. Maybe some of you are gonna embrace the fact that you're a high priestess. Could be the case. Okay. The hermit right here could be a Virgo. The hermit reverse right here is gonna live your life now, I feel. The hermit reverse, I'm gonna go live my life now to the fullest. Could be the case right here. Somebody's going to, I feel. I feel like somebody else over here though is depressed or something like that. Maybe they want to be with you, or they're just depressed because they have bad karma over here for something. And I'm getting like this bad karma runs really deep. It goes back to another lifetime and everything like that. It's, it's real deep. I'm getting here. But you're gonna free yourself, just pray you, okay? Yeah, so I'm getting like for some of you with the six of swords, every time I look at this card, I feel like this woman right here, it's like forcing you. So like somebody could be forcing you to another dimension. Or it could be right here, maybe somebody's trying to force you to have a child. Could be the case right here. Either way, I feel like that you're free right here. Okay, you're not going to be stuck in some way. Even if you do have a child, I feel like you're not stuck here, some type of way. Somebody wants to reconcile right here with you. I feel like they do. That's what people here. Even could be they have a child by somebody else. All right, that could be the case here. And you are going to free yourself right here. But somebody is heartbroken to see you go in some way. They're heartbroken about that, I feel. Okay. So we have right here the four swords. So I've got somebody contemplate about you, I feel, you know. How, you know, something something is the end of a difficult time for you. I feel like it's financially right here for some people right here. Right? You might even have insight about a vehicle, something like that, or cancer or something like that. The chariot is cancer. Right, but I feel like you're going to advance right now in your life in some way. You're freeing yourself from something or somebody here. You really are going to advance yourself. Your life is going to improve big time here, I feel. All right? I feel like that... Um, this is a cancer season. We're in cancer season right now. I feel like it's starting. Okay. That's what I have right here. Thank you so much for tuning to this message. Don't forget to give it a big fat thumbs up. Subscribe and even share it. Namaste to you. This is Earth, Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo.